Entertainment.com, Brittany Valadez. Right now, I'm in LA at the opening of Top Shop at the Grove. We got to see Demi Lovato perform her hit single, Give Your Heart a Break, and we chatted with the girls of Fifth Harmony. Lovato, lay clad in a silver studded cast, would not let her broken leg prevent her from belting out her hit, Give Your Heart a Break. Demi for the Los Angeles opening was newly formed group Fifth Harmony. Fans anticipated the girls' arrival, some lining up as early as 6 a.m. I caught up with the Fab Five at Mixology at the Grove where they dished on everything from their upcoming album to fashion, food, and their favorite Latina celebrity. Hey Latina.com, it's Brittany Valadez, and yes, I am with the beautiful, the amazing girl group Fifth Harmony. Hi, thank you. Hi. Magazine. Ali and I grew up together. We yes. were we were in school okay. together. Yes. So awesome. Yes. We're both from San Antonio, like and we both, you know, pursued right. a career in the uh, entertainment industry, and now we're here. It's amazing. Ali, I told you one day I'm going to be interviewing you in the red carpet, and wow, I know. And look, like it's that's amazing. You know what I mean? And on top of that, it's with four amazing girls. Honestly, Aww. Ali, yes, favorite Latina celebrity. Oh. Oh, girl. oh, oh Selena, is, yeah. Selena Quintanilla. Oh my God! Oh my gosh, Selena I love her so much. She, I think that's her favorite celebrity, like in general. Yeah, she of all always, time, my favorite entertainer of all time, Selena, Selena loves Quintanilla. I watched her video. I'm not even Latina, but I look at that movie all the time, and yeah. over every day. And the actress Jennifer Lopez oh, slash yeah. singer. Oh, listen, listen. Did you see label mates? Oh, Wait, wow. label mates. Is label this not for real? Crazy. Label mates. Label mates. With Epic. Yeah. Dinah, question for you. What is the cutest thing a boy has ever done for you? Oh, it's kind of hard because there's a lot of things. But oh. Hey, it's getting real in here. It's getting real. Please tell. Do tell. He took me to a Mexican restaurant. <laughs> Camila, favorite food? Favorite food. Uh, pizza. Um, no, because I always say pizza. Corn. I love oh, corn. corn yes. I literally love corn. But um, I I like I like French fries. The ones that are like the really brown ones. Normani, can you give us some spring fashion tips? What does Normani want to wear? Ooh, I like edgy stuff. I don't know. I'm into the spikes now, and then I like pops of color, and I like metallics. See my nails? It kind of has like the silver metallic on. Yep. So if I need to go shopping. Shopping buddy. Hey, you guys were on the X Factor. You placed third, like a huge group, One Direction. <laughs> They're really big. Woo! So I predict you guys are going to be really big. Oh, we hope so. to have like half the season. Yeah, I know. Right. Half would be nice. It'll happen. With five beautiful ladies as classy as you are, it'll happen. What advice would you guys give to young people that are going to be auditioning for the next season of X Factor? Basically, just go out there, have fun, live in the moment. Don't let your nerves get the best of you because I used to do that. One time I actually went on stage, ran off and cried. But, oh, um, yeah, it was hard. But you. just have fun and live in the moment and Be just you. go for it because you only live once, so YOLO. <laughs> First, I auditioned in front of, like, producers, right? And um, after you get a call from the producers, then you go into, the, like, the actual judges' auditions. So then after I went to the producers, Producers, they called me and they said like you can audition but as an alternate which means that if there were if there was extra time at the end of the show then I could audition I was literally standing there like with a microphone like about to audition they were like oh sorry time's up I was like crying and I was like even if there's no chance that I can audition tomorrow like let me come back and then Simon came out and then I was like Simon like can I can I please audition or whatever and then he was like yeah of course but he had no idea about the process for your album that's coming out what kind of sound are you hoping to give your audience it's probably gonna be like a pop little bit of R&B elements in it yeah because we want to do like pop music but we want to do pop music that like has vocals in it like in, like yeah. like we can sing can so we want to show that off if you guys could tour with anybody who would it be you can have more than one choice uh, I, if we could work with I would love to go on tour with Ed Ed Sheeran I'd love to go on tour with Beyonce, Beyonce. Oh my God. Me 
don't care. I love it. I think Beyonce is the winner. Um, if we did a tour with One Direction, that'd be so. One Direction would be fun. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. Bring your fans, all your fans together. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. Also, Demi. Oh, oh no. Don't forget her. Hello. No, Demi's gonna be on your album. It's been decided. <laughs> Has it? Okay. Yeah. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. All right. Well, there you have it, Latina.com viewers. It's been an awesome time with Fifth Harmony, ladies. Bye. Can you say bye to our readers? Bye. bye. Latina.com.